Hello gorgeous people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Will I ever start the vlog without a bumper hair on screen? Welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're new here then welcome. I hope you're all good. I am just jumping in at the start of the vlog before we get into this week's weekly diaries purely because I feel like the last few vlogs have started quite chaotic. So I thought, why not start it in a much calmer setting for once? I'm not driving, I'm not running around in London somewhere or at an event, saying a quick hello. Um, I thought I'd actually sit down and say hi because it's about time we brought the start of the vlogs back calmly. And another reason, because I basically wanted to come and show you what I had for dinner last night because it was chef's kiss and I was the chef, so kiss to myself. But I, as you know, get HelloFresh every single week because it is so convenient for me. But whilst I've got a code running, I always just like to throw it in at the start of my vlogs because I feel like so many of you come here for my HelloFresh code and it says you having to sit it out halfway through a four minute video. So my current HelloFresh code is ashm6025. I'll put it on screen here. I will also put a QR code on screen here because you can scan that if you're not watching me from your phone, if you're watching me from your TV or whatever just quickly scan it and it will take you straight to my offer. All of this information will be linked in the description box down below as well. I just wanted to get that out there because wait until you see what I ordered this week. I made this dinner last night for me, my dad and my brother because my dad stayed here last night and my sister-in-law was in work so the three of us sat down and had it together which was super cute but we were all just like we couldn't even speak when we were eating it because it was so nice. We had um, chicken wrapped in ham and tender sandwich you know is my favourite thing. I eat it every single day but the most unbelievable cheesy truffle potatoes. It was so good. Best thing about HelloFresh honestly is being introduced to new recipes. I love cooking as you know. I don't get to do it much these days but I actually adore being in the kitchen and I love my spicy food. I love cooking like good nutritionally rich food like meals it's just what I like to do and HelloFresh has introduced me to so many more things than I ever would have come across before or ever would have thought of to make and it always shows you how to make sauces from scratch with different ingredients as well rather than just buying like jarred or packet sauces which is just the best thing about it. It's just so convenient I feel like a lot of us hate doing the food shop. I absolutely hate it. When I do do one, I do it online. But actually doing the food shop gives me the fear because I'm like, oh, what do I want to eat this week? And then it just becomes repetitive. You end up eating the same meals, especially if you're like me, like you eat like lower calorie meals or like you eat a lot of like protein rich meals. They can become quite same, same. So it's good that I can filter it on the website to be like protein rich, lower calorie and just get different options every single week. But yes, yeah, super convenient, which is the best thing about it because my life is a hundred mile an hour and never in like one place for like, like the same amount of time or like the same time every week so it's so handy that I can just like get my HelloFresh delivered when I know I'm going to be home for like the next three nights. That's why whenever my code is on I always just quickly come and tell you on YouTube because I just think it's the best thing like 60% off your first box and 25% off your next eight boxes with my code. There is nothing better than discounted food and if you've not tried it before it's really worth doing whilst my code is on but let me know if you do or let me know if you've like been introduced to it through like my vlogs because god I've used HelloFresh now for a very long time. Is this not giving um, old school, like school vibes? Because I picked this little like plastic thing up in Home Bargains and I keep, I shit you not, every single HelloFresh recipe because I make things over and over again. Like every recipe I ever get is in here and it just slots on the shelf with my recipe books, my other cookbooks, because I go back to them all the time. Like once you've got your recipe cards, you're good to go. You know what you're doing. But yeah, current code, because I know so many of you wait out for it, is ashm6025. All the information will be down below and I'm going to love you and leave you and let's get into this week's vlog. Hello. Hello to the vlog. Hi, oh that's terrible. Hi, I know, yeah, let's get outside for Oh, we... it's very wet. Oh, guys, London is... London is London. It's not raining right now though, no? Oh, no. Right, which way are we going? Thank guys, you. we have just finished recording. Ep 2 is finito. Episode 2. It was a fun one, wasn't it? No, it is a good one. It's a good one. It's going to be good, so you'll see that next week. Um, but I... What was I going to say? Oh, I was going to show them around the studio, but we'll wait till it's less chaotic. 
yeah and now we've got like a good setup and yeah. we're getting relaxed into things you can yeah see you can it's more, like more natural vibes now because last week was chaos because we had to record the teaser and the first full episode so there was like no time we and were we recording until like five o'clock weren't we yeah and we didn't know like what we wanted it to look like like standing yeah. next to dance stuff so now we've got it down now we've got like the cameras right and everything the lighting right and um, we'll show you like the setup next week but now we're going to get some piercings piercings <laughs> doing it again <laughs> every time she says to me in a Geordie accent oh. I'm like oh oh my god oh my we god. nearly oh, I wish you got that no I should have got that I'll show you the clear your camera look at we look is it like we're in the clouds is it dirty it's okay oh yeah that's better uh, that man just slipped me over did you see that yeah, oh, he god. just slipped see that cardboard box there wet just, on the floor he just, he just went absolutely fucking flying oh pokey house do you like pokey balls what the hell's a pokey ball pokey ball where it's like rice why is what the fuck is that on the wall in there a hand with a fanny <laughs> <laughs> we'll show you around the podcast you do next week um but we're gonna go and grab some food and then we're going to super drive for like a little event is yeah. it yeah drop in, give it your best a little drop in pop in and i didn't hear a little pop <laughs> <laughs> We're doing piercings there, so we thought we'd go and say hello. And I mean, I don't know where I'm gonna fit a new piercing. Are we gonna find a prep? Yeah, we do. Because we need food. Um, but anyway, it's Thursday. It's officially podcast recording day, so we are done. We're done quite early. Well, it's three o'clock. We could have been done sooner. Yeah. We had a couple of meetings afterwards, though, so. Now we're gonna go and eat because we are oh, hungry, we are hungry gals. Oh, wrong way, wrong way. So I hate it when Pete, when you get a notification saying someone's remixed your meal, and she said, "Let's see what it is." And then she went, "Like, what the fuck does that say?" Do you know what I, I mean, mean? That could be anything. That could be like, "Kill this bitch." And I go, "Oh, <laughs> stunning, thanks." <laughs> Thanks for the repost. I get it all the time, right? I was just talking about this. When I was at Coachella, I had a notification. Yeah, what? Why? And someone remixed me real, right? And the, they had someone shagging and they put my face on it. I don't know where it is. <laughs> what? Yeah. And I was like, oh well. They remixed your real? Yeah. Into so a porno? Yeah, they made it. They like they did AI on us. It was so bad. But you know when you're so tired, you're like, not the day. Oh yeah, Coachella was getting yeah, tired. So it won't take a genius to guess why we had lunch. Well, it's a late lunch. We'll keep doing this. No. Keep eating. And it's like three o'clock and we've just eaten. Right, take like a genius to guess what I got. The falafel and hummus. I've convinced her to be a prep girl now. She's convinced me not only to be a prep girl. Or falafel. Falafel. But also, um, I think I might be trialing, trialing. I'm gonna try my best, guys, to do vegan yuri. Vegan <laughs> Is that how you say it? Yeah. Mika's just touching up her makeup, so about um, to leave. Yeah. But um, I'm gonna try my best because one, we think it'll be good content for the podcast, my little check-ins every week, and two, because for the animals, for the animals, like you guys know, I'm an animal lover. But to be fair, when it comes to meat, like I do pretty much only eat chicken. Like yeah. anything else, I eat very rarely if it's like a roast dinner out or something. But like. I love vegan food. Like everything we eat together, I'm like, yeah, I love. Yeah. And also, like, my mum was vegan for a while. Even now, like, cause obviously she started eating meat again when she was pregnant with me because she had to. But even now, like, when she eats meat, you want to see it. She like literally, she just picks it. Ooh, like, she's like, she just like, she's like, I just can't stomach it. Look what someone's just said on Hinge. Oh, oh for God's sake. <laughs> We were just talking about this on the podcast. You're gonna have to listen to see what it is and you can guess. Okay, we're in the Super Dash showroom. We're doing like um, embroidered scarves. Yeah, we'll be definitely doing one then. We will be. So, you darling. It's very skims. Yeah. Guys, who knew that Super Dry did so much like sequin vibes? Yeah, it's very random. Yeah. It's very random. It's very random. It's the first one. Oh, I love that. Oh, no, that's so nice. Silly Polly. That's skims. Yeah. Oh. I actually love that. It's so warm. Oh, this is giving like when I was 18 going to the club vibes. And when we used to have like multi coloured sequin dresses. <laughs> Look, they've got brown on the top. Oh, I like the brown. Actually. I really like the brown. The brown sushi. Oh, that wonder doll teeth is like you all. Oh, bye. Wow, that's right. There's a dog. There's a dog. Oh, hello. Oh, he's trying to get his own attention. Hello. What a lovely little boy. Okay, we're just doing our consent forms, piercings, and Megan's gonna get. A load done, I think. I think I'm gonna get hair done. Not that I need any more in this ear. But why not for the occasion? Come, girl. Some of our things now. Here we are. How are you feeling? Um, scared, shocked, nervous, on edge, excited. I think further down. 
Yeah. Andy Lindo in a jump man's getting a piercing. Can you vlog us? <laughs> I'll tell you what I can never do. I can never be a content creator. Really? Nah, fuck that. <laughs> well, it's a lot of it's like film everything, isn't you? Yeah. I'm like, that's just like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm fucking lord. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, we're not normal. Yeah, normal. <laughs> we should do a, like an episode in the store if you want. Oh my god, yeah! Oh my god, we, we can talk about, about all the things. Well, there's the so many. Yeah. Yeah. Great mini mic. <laughs> yeah. so, tell okay. us another piercing story. <laughs> my ear's not healing. I said, what are you cleaning it with? He said, urine. I said, I think that could be the problem, mate. You're talking. We actually thought that was going to make it. Mm. Why would you well, they, they say that you, if you're in the wild, if you cut yourself, as soon as you pee on it, it's sterile. Okay. But this was in a bottle. Oh, <laughs> oh no, that is wrong, man. You know the thing is when you go from the north to the south back to the north in one day you get all the seasons like it is hammering it down here and halfway through my journey home Josh called me and he was like just so you know like it's raining really heavily oh just in case obviously trains are affected and I was like no no all good um but in London it was like quite a nice-ish day except for like one little shower but it was it was warm I was hot there I was like oh it's too stuffy can we just say at that super dry pop-up sorry it's very chaotic because we actually had trains to catch um but we oh who's this Josh are you home um we absolutely vibed with those guys who own the piercing company I'm gonna put in that at here um because I always get asked about like my ear curation and a few of them I've got done in Cheshire some of them I got done in Astrid and Mew and then obviously that one I just got done by them at the event but they are so good like that guy it was him and his dad that own it and their dad has been piercing for like ever like he's pierced Rihanna's nipples and now he's pierced my ear so anyway we just got on with them like a house on fire i don't know what it was but like they were like do you two are you two like this all the time like are you just laughing all the time we were like yeah pretty much so obviously i've literally got seven holes now so i've got my main three then i got the upper so they're like two separate ones and then i got that one um and then obviously my conch and now i don't even know i think that's called a helix no i might have got that wrong i don't know what that's called helix i think this is a front helix that's Helix. But anyway, it's obviously very dark right now. It's half eight at night. And I am gonna drive home, quickly eat something, because all I've eaten all day is that pret salad, make a cup of tea, and then get into bed with bumper and snuggle, snuggle, snuggle. All is well, gorgeous people. I'm in bed with my little monkey. It's very dark in here, sorry, I've only got the lamp on. And Ducky. Good morning. It's 5.45 a.m. I'm exhausted, but we move. I'm grateful I get to move my body today. It's four sessions out of five this week. That's a randomly placed box of a look fantastic order. I just randomly opened one thing out of last night and thought hmm, that's a tomorrow problem. But anyway, it is a glute focused day today. I'm wearing my protein, obviously. I'm gonna get my ass to the gym. I journey pre workout. My piercing. We'll come back to that. I need to wash my hair. It's very, very, very greasy. Um, I'm gonna take pre-workout, get my ass to the gym, and we'll catch up when I'm back. Is there anything better? Oh, <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. I was gonna say them fresh bedding, but it's not so fresh when you're on it, is it, monkey? Just change the bed. My toxic trait is honestly changing the bedding like every two to three days. I know it's meant to be once a week, and it used to be for me on a Sunday, but at the moment, I'm just obsessed with fresh bedding. Just lit a candle, had a cup of tea, that open drawer is not the vibe i'm actually heading back to chester tonight because my best friend chloe and i are going for dinner a bottle of wine i'm staying at chloe so chloe and her boyfriend rich they live like near chester so i'm driving there it means i can actually drink um if i stay over there tonight so i won't be back here until tomorrow but it's just nice knowing that i'm coming home to fresh bedding decided i'm gonna go out and get a coffee because i've got a free starbucks don't even ask they gave me this thing i was waiting for my drink for ages the last time i was at the local drive through and they came out once I'd pulled up and they took really long even though I'd only ordered a like skinny latte or something um 
and they took ages so then when they came out they bought me like this little thing that says like have a drink on us like we're sorry so i'm gonna go and use that because why not have a little coffee to pre-drink and get ready with um and then i'm gonna take bumper out for a quick walk before it's time to feed him anyway yes i've had a bit of a spring clean this morning because i've been living out of like bags suitcases blah 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 it's just like things just get a lot so i've put all my clothes away done all my washing got a candle lit in the background this is the new neon hibernate candle this is their brand new scent um this year and honestly it is a dream anyway before i pop out i just thought i'd quickly mention i just made that clip um i've just posted just like a random video of like my skincare drawers on my story and people are like right okay we need a run through of skincare so i feel like maybe i should do like a little sit down chatty video oh that's heavy of my collection but not only that somebody was like uh hello like is there really a need for that many perfumes and also can we have a chat about perfumes but the only thing is with perfumes is it's really hard obviously to know what you're going to like through the screen because you have to smell them but i like to think i know my shit about scents so hopefully you can all trust me but do we want a little run through of like products what i've got going on here anyway who's been listening to the podcast i don't think this will ever get old look at this <sighs> that is us on spotify on my tv alongside other podcasts oh my days <laughs> there's our teaser episode welcome to talk with 30 there's our first official episode which i hope you've all listened to by now <gasps> this will just never ever ever get old guys let me know if you've been listening down below let me know what you think we've already worked out hang on let me turn you around again we've already um hello me <laughs> literally um this is like instagram versus reality look at that spot have I just noticed that? I need a patch there, never mind there. Um, anyway, yeah, we've worked out a little bit with sound um, because we feel like having listened to the first full episode, even though like we sound checked it and everything, there's always gonna be teething problems with like a new project. So we think our sound was a little bit off. We think I was a bit too quiet, Megan was a bit loud. So like we've adjusted all of that. So hopefully the next episode will sound and look even better with like cameras and stuff for our clips. So yeah, really, really exciting. But let me know if you've been listening. Just while I'm down here before I pop out, I've had a couple of cute cute little deliveries today got some new napco goodies if you don't know about this pajama brand through me then how because i wear it all the time honestly so like the best quality in the world but they stock in selfridges as well so if you don't want to order online or if you want to go and see it for yourself then you can pop into selfridges i think they're stocked in pretty much all the selfridges now i think in the uk um but i got these slippers which i've actually had before um but i got them covered in paint when i was decorating my room here when i first moved back how gorgeous are they? My little fluffy slip-ons. So I've got the little bra and then I've got the pyjamas. But this like sits underneath the pyjamas. I think I've got a medium in the bra. And then this also turned up from Look Fantastic, which is giving Christmas, isn't it? If you just take a first glance at it. The box is like such a silly box. Probably going to use that to re-gift this year, to be honest. Let's see what's in here. Oh my god. Oh look, how cute. Oh my god, that's got my name on it. So cute. Little Christmas shortbread biscuits hand painted. Oh no, they are so cute. I love how the biscuits are the first thing I get excited about. Wow, we have got so many goodies in here. Oliplex, Laura Mercier, Too Faced, all the inky list, neon Bobby Brown. We've got a MAC lipstick. What else is in here? Urban Decay. Oh my god, I've not seen that in years. That is Space Cowboy. I know that shade. Once a makeup artist, always a makeup artist. Wow, I've literally not seen that in ages. That is perfect for festive season. What's this? Oh, my favourite, the Yellow Mask OMG highlighter. Oh, I love that they've shipped one of those in because I'm literally about to run out. Benefit Fan Fest volumising score. I've never tried that one. I love Benefit's there real. Oh, Cordially spray. You guys know how much I go through this. This is the best spray for like end of skin and end of makeup. Oh, a little travel brush set. What does this say? Christmas is just around the corner and we hope you're so excited. We hope you love the spots of goodies filled with some of our favourite LF Beauty Foes and Christmas gift sets. We'd love for you could share on socials and doing with your personal discount code Asha LF. Just a heads up guys by the way, um, just so you know this isn't an ad or anything, this literally just ran a bit of PR that just arrived, but 
my code Asha LF, which I know you all know, this weekend, this is going up in real time, so when you see this on Sunday, it should still be valid, but it gives you an extra 10% off than it normally does this weekend on the website and also on the app. However, if you order through the app, you'll get the extra 10% off and a free Sol de Janeiro lip butter if you spend over £60, I think it is, um, while stock lasts, obviously, while they've got enough of them in stock. But yeah, that's an amazing lip butter that I always use. I always team it with a lip liner in the day. So definitely worth you having a little shot if you're watching this vlog in real time. And we have also got in the post for little babies, we've got some dog collars, matching dog collars and leads for the boys. Just look at, you can't stroke you, I'm trying to get to the lead. But the size difference, look at flashes and then look at bumpers. I can't. How cute. Oh my god, they're the most gorgeous. They're really, really good quality. Most gorgeous, like blue colour. So it's from a brand called Hot Dogs. Hello. It's from a brand called Hot Dogs. This is this is gonna be a struggle, isn't it? Oh wow. Wow, you want that much attention? Sorry, no can do, darling. No can do. There we go. They're from this brand, Hot Dogs Accessories, and this is a lovely local gal that has started this business of the collars and leads, and we love to support. Anyways, here's my little chilled outfit of the day before a glow up in a little while. We are matching because mummy's got your colours on, darling, hasn't she? Yes, she has. Anyway, coffee and walkies time. Mm. This is my little free thing, look. I want a for you. Hi, can I get a caramel waffle latte, please? Are you able to? Oh, just a regular, please. Can I get an extra shot of coffee? Extra shot of coffee. And are you able to make that with skinny milk? Yeah, Skimmed sure. milk. Yeah, thank you. I always say skinny as a habit, but I hate that term. Yeah, fine. Fab. That's it. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Just for the baby. He knows. He knows. You little monkey. In a minute, guys. I think he's enjoying it. I think he's enjoying it. Should we try? Oh, this is a new cup. Oh no, I hate it when they don't go back into the thing. I have to go in a minute, bubs. So we've got a place to be. What's to go on? Do you have a black blazer? I've got one, but I don't like it. Yes, Chloe, I do, my darling. Yes, I do, bubs. I'll bring it. It's just girl chat, isn't it? So I don't like girl chat. I fucking love this shit. Guys, this is the one thing I miss when being down south. Is the fact the beach is two minutes. A two-minute drive from my house. See, this is why Bumper got brought up as a puppy, right? So it's used to the outdoor space and being by the sea. So I think he missed it more than me, but honestly, we are so lucky. We're so, so lucky. Excuse me. Oh, I was going to ask if you've got a spare poo bag. Yeah. Sorry, I've already used one no, and he's done worry. another poo. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Bumper. Okay. Hi right, then, with your new family. He's like, don't make me go away from my girlfriend. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. This way. Here. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy, Bumper. You are good sometimes when you're not judging everybody. The sea is oh, <laughs> oh my god. The sea is so strong. The smell of it. Excuse me. We don't go that far now, do we? It's really strong. It's rare that you get the strong smell of the sea at this time of year. Only in the summer when it's a bit warmer. Hmm. Sad that I know that really. Good boy, Bumpy. You should go get your din dins now. Wow, white new balance was not, not a good idea. Okay, we are all ready for girls night. Mind the washing rack. Um, I know it's fucking freezing, which is why I've got a place there. Um, but I've just got this little satin crop top and necktie and I always wear these together. I've got the black version too. Necktie and crop top is from Miss Cat. And then I've got this really old chocolate skirt, which is actually misguided. I know, literally vintage at this point. I've got my brown Burberry bag because it goes really nice. And then I've just got my June heels on, my nude version. Also have these in black. If I love something and it becomes a staple, the top, the shoes, I buy it in the other colours available. Here is my makeup of the evening. Just get a light so you can see it. Wow. Wow. Sorry, bright. There we go. Just something simple, a little bit smoky. Nothing crazy. This is choking me a little bit. 
Hmm. Anyway, I am going to drive to Chloe's now. I won't take the vlog come out tonight, but I might get some clips on my phone. Little girls night. I'm um, going to go to Chloe's, have a glass of wine there, and then Chloe's boyfriend's dropping us off into Chester, which is great. So we can actually enjoy a bottle of wine with our food. We're going to Artisan, which... Oh, just look at this window, by the way. It's all going on in here. Yeah, we're going to Artisan, which we haven't been to in ages, but they only had like bar tables available for us because we bought super last minute. So it's what it is. I actually like sitting at the bar sometimes because it's more like nibbles and wine vibes. But anyway, I'll see you on my phone and I'll catch up with you all properly in the morning. Cheers. Thank you so much. Cheers. Taste test. Oh, guys, they just brought over shots for us. Cheers to a baby. Is it baby Guinness, isn't it? Problem. Wow. Enjoy the food so far? Yeah, it's so good. Thank you. Enjoy, Thank you. That's like a more. That was like strawberry. Cheers. Ugh. Is it? Oh. You can't break it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Thank you. No, honestly. Chloe just said, tonight I'm going to be sick on the duvet. The last time we were in Chester and we were doing tequila together, Chloe. Oh, I was sick all over the bed. I was asleep when I did it, by the way, just to clarify. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. They look after me in this house, let me tell you. Wowzers. Guys, I just edited the vlog, the full vlog. And then I was like, it didn't even run at the vlog after we went out. So here I am the next day, wet hair, napco pajamas on. They're appearing really orange on my camera by the looks of it. Let me turn the light off. There we go, that's better. This is like the true colour, but wow, look how blue everything else looks. Wow, it goes so dark so early these days. I hate winter, I hate the whole like weather change. Also, these are the fluffy slippers. So this is the matching two-piece set and the sleep bra. It's so nice, feeling a little bit rough, but I've had a gym session, smashed it out. Um, got quite a busy week next week. Next week's vlog is going to be a lot more going on, but it's just so up and down, isn't it? My life is like chilled one week. Another week is absolutely manic. But yeah, really busy week incoming, really, really exciting things going on. So next week will be a fun one, but I hope you've enjoyed a nice little quiet vlog, I guess, for a change. And I just want to say again, thank you so, so much for everybody's love on the podcast. Honestly, it's just it's just gone exactly how we wanted it to when we launched it and we are so so buzzing so thank you so much for not only being a lovely part of the vlog gang but also for supporting that as well if you haven't had a listen yet then please do so and also it massively helps us the little um five star rating thing on spotify so anybody has spotify and listens on there if you could give us a little rating that would be amazing but yeah thank you again so so much for all of the support on that we are so buzzing and we've just got so much planned for next year with the podcast which is super exciting but anyway i'm gonna love you leave you round up this week's weekly diaries here i'll see you all in next week's vlog bye